ಹಾಯ್ ಎವ್ರಿವಾನ್ ವೆಲ್ಕಮ್ ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ ಟು ಮೈ ಕ್ಲಾಸ್ ಸ್ಟೂಡೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಇವತ್ತಿನ ಸೆಷನಲ್ಲಿ ಪೀರಿಯಾಡಿಕ್ ಕ್ಲಾಸಿಫಿಕೇಶನ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ಈ ಲೆಸನ್ ರಿಲೇಟೆಡ್ ಕೆಲವೊಂದು ಕ್ವೆಶನ್ಸ್ನ ಸಾಲ್ವ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾ ಇದ್ದೀನಿ ಸೊ ಯಾಕೆ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ಸಾಲ್ವ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾ ಇದ್ದೀನಿ ಅಂದರೆ ಸೊ ಈಸಿಯಾಗಿ ಈ ಲೆಸನಿಂದ ಕೇಳುವಂಥ ಲಾಸ್ನ ನೀವು ಬರಿತೀರಾ ಬಟ್ ವೆನ್ ಇಟ್ ಕಮ್ಸ್ ಟು ಮೆಟಾಲಿಕ್ ಕ್ಯಾರೆಕ್ಟರ್ ಆಗಿರ್ಬೋದು ನಾನ್ ಮೆಟಾಲಿಕ್ ಕ್ಯಾರೆಕ್ಟರ್ ಆಗಿರ್ಬೋದು ಯಾವುದೋ ಒಂದು ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ನ ಪೀರಿಯಾಡಿಕ್ ಟೇಬಲಲ್ಲಿ ಡಿಪಿಕ್ಟ್ ಮಾಡೋರಿದ್ದು ಆಗಿರ್ಬೋದು ಅಥವಾ ಎಲೆಕ್ಟ್ರಾನಿಕ್ ಕಾನ್ಫಿಗರೇಷನ್ ಆಗಿರ್ಬೋದು ಸೊ ಈ ಒಂದು ಪಾರ್ಟಲ್ಲಿ ನೀವು ಫೇಲ್ ಆಗ್ತೀರಾ ಸೊ ತುಂಬ ಈಸಿ ಈ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ ಸೊ ನೀವು ಏನು ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ಅಂದರೆ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಲರ್ನ್ ಒನ್ ಟು ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಅಟಾಮಿಕ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೇರ್ ನೇಮ್ಸ್ ಅಂದರೆ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ನೇಮ್ ಗೊತ್ತಿರಬೇಕು ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ನೇಮ್ ಗೊತ್ತಿದ್ರೆ ಅದರ ಆರ್ಡರ್ ಪ್ರಕಾರನೇ ಅಟಾಮಿಕ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಇರುತ್ತೆ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ವೆರಿ ಸಿಂಪಲ್ ಸೊ ಎಲೆಕ್ಟ್ರಾನಿಕ್ ಕಾನ್ಫಿಗರೇಷನ್ ಕೂಡ ಹಿಂದಿನ ನಾನು ಕ್ಲಾಸಸಲ್ಲಿ ಹೇಳ್ಕೊಟ್ಟಿದ್ದೀನಿ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಚೆಕ್ ಮೈ ಪ್ರೀವಿಯಸ್ ವೀಡಿಯೋಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಈ ಲೆಸನ್ ಏನಾದರೂ ನಿಮಗೆ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಡೌಟ್ ಇದ್ದರೆ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಚೆಕ್ ದ ಪ್ಲೇ ಲಿಸ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಪೀರಿಯಾಡಿಕ್ ಕ್ಲಾಸಿಫಿಕೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ಮೈ ಚಾನಲ್ ಸೊ ಯು ವಿಲ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಈಚ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ ಇನ್ ಡೀಟೇಲ್ ಸೊ ದೆನ್ ಲೆಟ್ಸ್ ಗೆಟ್ ಸ್ಟಾರ್ಟ್ ಸೊ ಇವತ್ತಿನ ಸೆಷನಲ್ಲಿ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಸ್ಟಾರ್ಟ್ ವಿತ್ ದ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಕ್ವೆಶನ್ಸ್ ದ ಅಟಾಮಿಕ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಸೊ ಈಗ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನೋ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ ಇದೆ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನೋ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ನ ಅಟಾಮಿಕ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಸೊ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನೋ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ ಯಾವುದು ಅಂತ ಹೇಗೆ ಗೊತ್ತಾಗುತ್ತೆ ಇಫ್ ಯು ನೋ ದ ನೇಮ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿಯತ್ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವೆರಿ ಸಿಂಪಲ್ ಸೊ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ನ ಒಂದು ಸತಿ ನಿಮಗೋಸ್ಕರ ನಾನು ಬರ್ ತೋರಿಸ್ತೀನಿ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ವೆರಿ ಸಿಂಪಲ್ ವೆರಿ ಈಸಿ ಟು ರಿಮೆಂಬರ್ ಸೊ ಇನ್ ಆರ್ಡ್ ಆಮ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ರೈಟ್ ಸೊ ದ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಹೈಡ್ರೋಜನ್ followed by helium second element third element is lithium then fourth beryllium boron carbon nitrogen oxygen fluorine neon okay see 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so the atomic number is the place of that element okay so 11th element is sodium then magnesium aluminum silicon phosphorus sulfur chlorine argon potassium and calcium so 20th element is calcium so the atomic number of the element x is 20 antandre the element is calcium okay so the element is now calcium so the next question here the sub first uh, sub question yenu andre determine the position of element x ಇನ್ ದ ಪೀರಿಯಾಡಿಕ್ ಟೇಬಲ್ ಪೊಸಿಷನ್ ಅಂದರೆ ಯಾವ ಪೀರಿಯಡಲ್ಲಿದೆ ಯಾವ ಗ್ರೂಪಲ್ಲಿದೆ ಅಂತ ನೀವು ಐಡೆಂಟಿಫೈ ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ವೆರಿ ಸಿಂಪಲ್ ನಾನು ಮುಂಚೆನೇ ಹೇಳಿದ್ದೀನಿ ಒಂದು ಸ್ಮಾಲ್ ಬೋರ್ಡ್ ರೀತಿ ನೀವು ಕಲ್ತ್ಕೊಳ್ಬೇಕು ಸಿ ಫಾರ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಸೊ ಪ್ರೀವಿಯಸ್ ಕ್ಲಾಸಲ್ಲೂ ಕೂಡ ನಾನು ಇದೇ ರೀತಿ ಬೋರ್ಡ್ ಬರೆದು ಹೇಳ್ಕೊಟ್ಟಿದ್ದೀನಿ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ನ ಪೊಸಿಷನ್ಸ್ನ ತಿಳ್ಕೊಡೋದು ವೆರಿ ಸಿಂಪಲ್ ಸೊ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ನೀವು ಕಲ್ತ್ಕೊಳ್ಬೇಕಾಗಿರೋದು ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಟೂ ಗ್ರೂಪ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಸ್ಟಾರ್ಟ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ತರ್ಟೀನ್ತ್ 14th 15th 16th and 18th and you also have to learn four periods 1 2 3 and 4 so first group second group 13th 14th 15th 16th 17th and 18th group first period second period third period and fourth period nimge gottirbeku iga elements ana bareda the first element is hydrogen it is in the first group and the second element is helium it is in the 18th group because this is the inert element okay so next third element is lithium next beryllium boron carbon nitrogen oxygen fluorine and neon next sodium magnesium aluminum silicon phosphorus sulfur chlorine argon potassium calcium iste istinna niu kalthkondre 20 elements yav period alide yav group alide adar atomic number everything nimge gottagutte thumbane simple so iga first 20 elements na nan illi barididini periodic table alli so ide chart na niu kalthkondre exam alli baruvanta yavde ondu question ge thumba simple agi answer ma
so second group fourth period okay so which is the element element is calcium and you also must write its electronic configuration configuration in o20 alva so it is 2 comma 8 comma 8 comma 2 so this is the electronic configuration of calcium so electronic configuration in a previous video only hail code you can check out the video how to write the electronic configuration of first 20 elements so the next question is very simple first answer second question is write the formula when x reacts or combines with the another element y whose atomic number is 8 you got x and element there so our element na atomic number is 20 and when this x element which is known as the calcium when it combines with the y so which is the y element we have to find out now so y is having the atomic number 8 so the eighth element is oxygen you can find out here the eighth element is oxygen so when it combines and you have to write the similar formula see when x combines with y it is x y okay so it is ca combining with o it is cao calcium oxide okay so this is the second question answer very simple so find out the element and combine the element with other element okay and the third question is what would be the nature of the compound form so in the lab activities in the previous sessions so metallic oxides are basic in nature so what is the question here what would be the nature of compound form whether it is acidic or basic you have to find out so it will be basic so all the metallic oxides are basic in nature whereas all the non-metallic oxides are acidic in nature for this i have conducted an activity when magnesium is uh, reacting so when we burn the magnesium magnesium the burn in the presence of oxygen we got magnesium oxide right which is the white powder so our white powder now when we dissolve or when we mix it with the water it forms a magnesium oxide right so other than our litmus paper nearly test madaga so the red color litmus paper will change its color to blue so this indicates that metallic oxides are basic in nature clear so all the three question very simple answer salpa new yochne madbeku so if you have to answer this question you should know the first 20 elements atomic number followed by their names must and should so adu gottirbeku andre ee ondu table na kalthkondre saaku yava element yava period alide yava group alide so ee rithi new find out madbodu i hope you understood this question so let's move for the next question the next question is so an element is placed in the second group and third period in the periodic table so ee table nimge exam alli kottirala nan aagle heldange ee table na kalthukondre you can write answer for any question so iga en helta idare ondu element ide aa element to second group alli ide yav group alli second group alli and third period alli ide third period alli ide okay so ee ondu element na naavu burn madidre so iga naavu sodium na consider madakke aagala as it is in the first group so in the second group which is the element the element is magnesium so iga namge element yavudu anta gothaitu an element is placed in the second group third period so second group alli third period alli iruvanta element magnesium okay so the magnesium anta gothaitalva the element is magnesium so when it burn what is going to burn magnesium is going to burn when it burn in the presence of oxygen to form the basic oxide and the question put it so ela identify maadbeku anta sub question alli nododadre the first question is identify the element so we have already identified the element the element is magnesium second write its electronic configuration so electronic configuration gottirbeku bariyodu hege antandre so you, you must know the atomic number of it so magnesium's atomic number is 12 so its electronic configuration is 2 comma 8 comma 2 it hege anta nimge gottide so write the balanced equation second question ge answer aitu iga and the third question write the balanced equation when it burns it andre eno magnesium when it burns in the presence of air magnesium en aagtide air alli burn aagtide the white dazzling light baruthe burn aagbekadre so magnesium when it burn in the presence of oxygen it forms magnesium oxide magnesium oxide form agutte this is a metallic oxide okay so balance maadbeku ili 2 ide alva 
So if you write 2 here, it will become 2 MgO. So you must write 2 here. So 2 Mg plus O2 gives rise to 2 MgO. Magnesium burn in the presence of oxygen to give magnesium oxide. So third question ke answer I do. In a fourth question, write the balanced equation when this oxide is dissolved in water. You can magnesium oxide delva. So magnesium oxide in today it is going to dissolve in the water. In today, water to dissolve today. So it will form magnesium hydroxide. MgOH2. Magnesium hydroxide. So now you have to check whether it is balanced or not. So check Madhadi. Let us check. See one atom of magnesium in the reactant side. In the product also one atom of magnesium. Oxygen there are two atoms. Ili OH2 agrodrinda E2 bandhu oxygen and hydrogen eruduku koda multiply agate. So there are two atoms of oxygen. Whereas two atoms of hydrogen and two atoms of hydrogen. So it is already balanced. So once again I repeat see magnesium oxide na water will dissolve madre. Question is write the balanced equation when this oxide, this oxide and the yaudu, we got magnesium oxide. Magnesium oxide, when it dissolves in the water, we get magnesium hydroxide. Clear? And this question is now answered. And the last question is, draw an electron dot structure for the formation of the oxide. So, we got the magnesium oxide, right? So, we have to write the electron dot structure for the magnesium and oxygen. So, when magnesium and oxygen, when they combine, in agate, there is transfer of electrons. See, for example, you got magnesium genodi. So, magnesium has how many electrons? Two valence electrons. Correct. So, it two valence electron, it can easily donate. Magnesium can easily donate two electrons. So, magnesium is donating two electron. So, thereby it is becoming Mg2+. So, two electrons in a magnesium donate mark today. So, it was 2, 8, 2. Now, by donating two electrons, it is becoming 2, 8. Yeah, okay, because by having eight electrons in its outermost shell, now it is stable. Okay. So, next oxygen, nodi. oxygen's atomic number is 8. Its electronic configuration is 2, 6. Okay, now. So, oxygen ke outermost electro, uh, valence uh, shell ali. So, it is having 6 electrons, valence electron. It needs only 2 electrons to become stable. So, oxygen in what 2 electrons in a, it will gain. Understand? So, here oxygen is 2, 6. It needs 2 electrons. So, it needs 2 electrons. So, 2 electrons in a togondo oxygen is becoming O2 minus. So, this is 2, 8. Okay, so E rithi equation in a new bari beku. Magnesium, once again I repeat, see, magnesium get 2, 8, 2 is the electronic configuration. It can easily lose two electrons, thereby it will become stable. So, two electrons na lose maartta hai Oxygen in beku, two electrons beku because six valence electrons are the outermost orbitally. Okay, so two electrons na tawalta hai O in maartta hai oxygen, two electrons na tawalta hai thereby it is becoming O2 minus. So, the electron structure is See, magnesium Mg2 plus. Okay. So, oxygen is O. So, two electrons in matter the magnesium in the it is receiving. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. This is the original uh, electron dot structure for the oxygen. So, by receiving two electrons from magnesium, it is becoming O2 minus. So, this is how you write the electron dot structure. Artha Tidila. So, Eriti question nimge 4 mark at the 3 marks ge keltare. Very simple. Only e table gotide ni answer madbudu yaudi question gadru. Table gotidre nimge atomic number gotirite, atomic number gotidre, elements name gotirite, elements name gotidre, obviously electronic configuration tumbane easy. Istina kalt kondre Eriti a question in a new tumba simple agi answer madbudu. So, easy agi 3 to 4 marks na nyo padkol bodu. It is not that idhe question baratela, e pattern na nyo questions barate. 
understand so in the next video only i am going to teach you some of the question which is based on the metallic and non metallic character electropositivity and electronegativity anta yen heltivi ee ondu area dali questions anna kottaga you will always have lot of confusions so other related aagi next video na nanu post martini hope ee video dali hel kottiruva eradu prashne galu nimge artha agide ankotini so if you feel this video is useful kindly like share and subscribe to my channel thank you so much for watching my video